I've been asked if I've got any words for Tyler Devlin before our death match in January at Kumite. And I do. I've got some words. But first I want to pay the man his due respect. You see, Devlin, I've been I've been a fan, I've been I've been studying UK deathmatch long before any motherfucker was calling this a scene. So I know exactly who you are and I know exactly what you are capable of and that's why I'll hold my hands up with all due respect and say that you Devlin are the past and the present of UK Deathmatch the unfortunate thing for you though my friend is that you're looking into the cold dead eyes of the future of UK Deathmatch because if you haven't already heard the clamouring if you haven't already heard the rumours then let me be the first to tell you that Alton Fawn the King Freak is the most sadistic motherfucker in the game right now <laughs> and that's the reason that I will be the most dangerous person that you have ever faced in your entire career. I know, I know what everybody's thinking. Well, what about the big names that he's faced? What about all the top talent? Nah, 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 nah. Now me, me, it's my time because I have been sat on the sidelines this whole time whilst you've been traveling up and down the country, tearing your body to shreds. I have been sat patiently watching, patiently waiting, Coming up with ideas, schemes, concoctions, disgusting, despicable ways to tear at the human anatomy. And I intend to start with you! <laughs> that... That's not even the main reason that I am the most dangerous person you will ever face Devlin now. The main reason... You're looking at a man with nothing to lose. You see, whether your hand is raised at the end of the match or not, you can't beat me. All you can do is level me up. See, I'm right at the start of my deathmatch journey. I'm only just beginning to write the first page of my deathmatch journey. And what an honour. What a privilege it will be, as a fan, to write the last chapter of yours, with all due respect.